This new addition to Photoshop to create your own presets is built upon the adjustment layers where you can add as many different adjustment layers as you want. For this example, I'm going to go for a vintage look. So I'm adding hue, saturation, and then going into color balance and just adjusting whether it's the shadows, midtones, or highlights. Whatever you do with the adjustment layers is entirely up to you. And then throughout the entire process, you can go back and re-edit and just fine tune these. For this, I'm working with shadows just to bring in some blues into the shadows. And then I'm going to add some highlights to this. And I'm just going to warm the highlights up slightly. As I said, this is my own personal choice with this vintage look. From here, I'm going to get into curves and I'm going to use the hand tool to basically adjust the curves because that I find personally easier adjusting the curves so that I'm actually choosing parts of the image and colors within the image to adjust that. After that, I'm going to go in and I'm going to add a black and white layer. And with this, I'm not going to edit the black and white layer. I'm simply going to turn the opacity down and that's just basically again to desaturate the entire image push the yellows adjust them just whatever you want to do to create this now to create your preset you select all of your adjustment layers and with them all selected go into adjustments click on your presets and hit the plus button name that in this case i'm going to name this vintage click ok and now that's me i can add this to any image whatsoever From here, I can go into the folder and I can adjust any of these. Let's take it into another image, vintage, there you go. And I can get in and adjust any part of this and finally in here as well. So this is a brilliant way to create and save your own presets within Photoshop. Mm -hmm.